If I say Jesus is our Father God in heaven, 85% of you Christians lose your minds. But there is one verse in the Bible y'all don't seem to know. And so I challenge you to contend with the word of God here. Wolfpox? Blake speaks fire? I demand an answer from you fellas. Revelation 21 verse 7, Jesus says, He who overcomes, I will be his God and he shall be my son. And don't try to argue that that's not Jesus talking there. He concludes the matter with, I, Jesus, have sent mine angel to testify to the churches. So I won't hear a word of that. He says it twice, Revelation 21 and Revelation 22, I am the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. To he who overcomes, I will be his God and he shall be my son. Jesus is our Father God in heaven. How so? Well, he also said, how is it you say, show me the Father? If you have seen me, you have seen the Father. He also said, my Father and I are one. What did he mean there? Brothers and sisters, I tell you no lie. The heaven of heavens cannot contain God. The heaven of heavens is paradise, the third heaven where the throne of God is. Colossians chapter 1 informs us that the image of God sitting on the throne in heaven is the Son, S-O-N. The Father is outside of creation entirely. Even the heaven of heavens where the throne of God is cannot contain him. Heaven and earth are his creation. How could he fit inside of this? God the Father sits on his throne in the paradise of heavens as his only image, his only form, the only begotten Son of God. The Son, who is the express image of the invisible God. The Son of God by which all things are created through, by, and for. Through him were all things created, whether they be heaven, earth, or powers and principalities, dominions, and thrones. All things are created by him and for him. Beside him there is no savior. Before him was no God formed and neither shall there be after him. He is before all things and by him all things consist. In the beginning was the word and the word was with God and the word was God. And God from heaven, the son, the only begotten image of God, the word of God was made flesh and dwelt among us. Jesus said, my father and I are one and there is no lie in him. And when Thomas, who doubted, put his fingers into the prints of the nails and thrust his hand into the side of our Lord and Savior, he hit his knees and said, My Lord and my God, and that is the God of Abraham, and that is the God of Isaac, and it is the God of Israel. In every instance of the Old Testament, when God is speaking through his prophets, it is Jesus Christ. He is the Word. He commanded that we baptize the nations in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. And that name is given, and there is only one, and we are baptized in the name of our Lord Jesus. Jesus, our Father and God in heaven.